Hi, I'm Jenny Clark. I founded Star Thrower Group in 2018, so we're coming up on our fourth year. We serve young adults with special needs from the ages of 21 to maybe about 40. So we're not a day program, we run a community center and it provides uh, the young adults with a place to belong. So we, we have memberships, they come and they become a part of our organization and work on different projects based on their interests, based on what's going on locally in the community. We do a lot of service projects, we do a lot of educational projects, and we're trying to help them to not just get a job, but build their life. There's clearly a need, not just in our area, but in Somerset County, in Mercer County, we have people coming in from as far away as Hamilton and uh, Franklin Park. We, we're really expanding, and as we expand, everybody's interests uh, come through, and we have projects that we're working on. One of them is STG TV. We have our own YouTube channel. Some of the projects we're doing in our TV studio right now is the members are actually writing a game show and they're writing a TV show. So they're, they're working on those skills of, of writing and, and creating and editing and it's, it's collaborating. There's just so many great things that are happening right here and having the tools and the resources to be able to then take what they've written and put it up onto a monitor so they can watch it as a teleprompter and to be able to do their performances would be really um, an exciting thing for them. It would help them to be able to do it in a more professional manner and to actually see how it works in a real TV studio. Um, and to produce it and to do the camera work. We have members who are learning how to use the camera and what we've seen in growth in the last three years from this is just amazing in their reading ability, uh, confidence in public speaking, uh, even speech therapy, the ability to speak more clearly. We have speech therapists on staff who work with them to develop that skill so that they have techniques that they can do to be able to focus before they're going to speak in front of the camera or in front of a group. Another byproduct of working with the camera so much is we have noticed an improvement in eye contact and as some of you may know when you have autism a lot of times it is very awkward to maintain or give eye contact. One of the tenets of our mission is building an inclusive community and inclusion is so important and everybody here this is a safe space and we really want to help them to realize that everybody has something that they're struggling with. We've been really fortunate in the last four years of business to have made all of these great connections with the local uh, store owners and, and business people and we're really grateful to be working with Lowe and Patel Orthodontics. Many of our members were clients of Lowe and Patel and have beautiful smiles because of it. So as you can see it takes a village to make things happen and we are very grateful to Central New Jersey and, and the people and businesses that we get to work with here in this area.